been really interesting this semester learning about small groups and communication patterns, the dynamic and the output um, of successful and not so successful small groups. Small groups can be seen in a variety of settings and places including the workplace, volunteer group, your church, school group projects, and even outer space. <laughs> the pleasure of doing a movie analysis with um, Lisette, Robert, and Melissa, and we focused on Guardians of the Galaxy. It's really cool to watch it again through the lens of small groups communica communication to see how they were successful as a group. Um, we chose to focus on their successes and some of the factors that went into their success, and I specifically focused on cohesion. Our text outlined five main strategies aimed at building and maintaining cohesion. And they are um, encourage compatible membership, develop shared goals, accomplish tasks, develop a history of cooperation, and encourage acceptance of fellow members. Um, it was really cool to see how going through the movie these steps were accomplished one by one by one and it contributed to them of course defeating Ronan the villain and uh, obtaining the infinity stone so going again through cohesion starting from the top um, encouraging compatible membership now on the surface of course it didn't really look like they were that compatible I mean they're all different kind of beings we had a human um, we had even a humanoid tree Groot but going deeper, digging a little bit deeper beyond the surface, you see that they, they do have a common thread there and it is one kind of a loneliness and just kind of wanting to belong somewhere. So, moving on to the next, uh, a shared goal. So initially each of them had their own uh, goal, individual goal that they wanted to accomplish, um, whether it be revenge or escaping a warlord stepfather. Um, or just getting the money. But towards the middle of the movie, we see that um, they come into possession of this Infinity Stone, and they see it's got awesome powers, but it can also create awesome devastation. So as a group, they decide to come together for the greater good and try to save the galaxies just to make sure it doesn't fall into the wrong hands, aka Ronin's hands. So that right there, a shared goal critical for cohesion. Um, going to a history of um, cooperation and uh, accomplished tasks, um, it gave us so many instances in the movie. It was really cool from them escaping out of jail, um, escaping the Ravagers, um, and of course ultimately defeating Ronan and Nebula um, there at the end. And the part that I really liked was encouraging the acceptance of the fellow members. So, you know, again, they're coming in with their own baggage, each like really hurt, each really scarred with their past. And that's where you see um, them really coming together. Once they really start accepting each other, um, caring beyond just the mission, you know, caring just beyond getting this one task accomplished, they actually start to really care for each other. And that is a critical factor um, in cohesion which is the social output of um, small groups. So again, it was a really interesting movie. Um, I loved it from the first time that I saw it, but it, I had a greater appreciation from coming into it and watching it through the lens of the small Why are you doing this? Why?